Joining us now, the Coach's Corner, North Dakota Hockey Assistant Coach Brad Berry as his team prepares for the NCAA Tournament opening round, Midwest Regional, Cincinnati against the Wisconsin Badgers on Friday night. Brad, uh, thanks for coming over to the Coach's Corner. Appreciate it. Anytime, Tim. Hey, how about the fact that you guys have been in the NCAA Tournament 12 consecutive seasons? We really found out this year with 23 wins and barely getting in that it's tough to get in, isn't it? It's tough, especially, uh, you know, the conference we're in, and uh, that tells you how much the non-conference schedule uh, impacts what, what we do. 23 wins normally gets you in pretty good. Yeah. This year, uh, barely got us in. 23 wins usually get you a number two seed, yeah, absolutely. for that matter. Yeah, yeah. Well, Wisconsin did you a favor on Saturday night by beating uh, Ohio State in overtime, coming from behind to do that, a couple goals down in the third period. Now you, instead of returning the favor, they might wish that they had lost that game so they wouldn't have to play you. That's what well, you intend to make it for them, Yeah, right? we intend to make it hard, but uh, you know, obviously we wear green all the time and we were wearing red after our game and cheering for cheering for Wisconsin. Now we turn the page and uh, and we're going to be battling them. So uh, it makes out to be a great great uh, game in the fact that two similar teams as far as record-wise and stats-wise. What's the biggest key? I, I, it seems to me when you guys are playing with speed, yeah. generating a lot of speed, coming out through the neutral zone, into the zone, possessing the puck, but I think speed is seems to me to be the key ingredient. Would you concur? I, I, I agree totally. <laughs> playing with speed, playing fast, taking away time and space. You know, the other thing is taking care of the puck, and, and sometimes players don't like to hear it about neutral zone, taking care of the puck. What does that mean? Well, getting it deep and not turning it over, making them come back the other way. A lot of teams now are great transition teams that, that get a lot of their offense because it's so tough to score a goal in offensive zone play that a lot of times pucks uh, go in the net because of transition. Play. Brad, what makes you confident in your team going into this tournament? I, I just think that uh, we're a four-line team, six defensemen that roll, and, and we're not a one-line team. And, uh, you know, you, you look at all the good teams that go on to win, and, and those are the teams that have depth, and I think we have depth. And you have Zane Gothberg yeah. behind, and uh, he's been nothing short of spectacular, yeah. I think. Failed to mention that, but yeah, absolutely, he's been a rock back there. And, uh, you know, it's nice to know that a guy's back there that can make a save at any key point time of a game. Talk about the difference in, in playing in front of what you normally have a very friendly and raucous crowd. Yeah at Ralph Ingolstadt Arena, you're gonna to go to Cincinnati. I'm guessing it's not gonna be a big crowd. It might be similar to Grand Rapids last year. Yeah. What, what difference does that make? Well, I think it makes a little bit of a difference as far as momentum uh, in times of games. Obviously, we're very appreciative of our crowd and it really helps us, but I think it was a learning experience last year in Grand Rapids and we have most or all of the same players we did last year and, and no one that we have to create our own uh, excitement. And, uh, and just by being in Grand Rapids, I think it helped us as far as what we have to prepare this year. That's the other thing. You have people that have been there. How much, how much, how long can that go for you? I, I, I think it's a lot. You know, you talk about Wisconsin's experience with juniors and seniors. It's no different with us. We got a lot of older veteran players that have been been through the wars uh, postseason, and I think it will help us. Looking forward to it. That's good luck. Thank you very much, sir. That's what assistant coach Brad Berry joining us uh, today on the Coach's Corner.